Hello, Juan. How are you doing? Can you hear me? Hello, teacher. I am fine, thanks. And you? I'm terrific. Thank you for asking. Enjoying the weather. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Did you work today? Yes. That's nice. Uh, how are you doing with the platform? Have you finished the exercises from session one? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, that's perfect. What about section two? Have you started the section two? Yes, that's finished. Okay, perfect. That's terrific. Congratulations. Thanks. What about the rest? How are you doing, Jonathan? Hi, teacher. Hi, how's everything? So-so? Mm. <laughs> So-so. Okay, I imagine. What about the rest of you? How are you doing, Manuel? Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? All right, thank you. That's perfect. Gabriela, how's everything? Gabriela? Hello. Hi, Gabriela. How's everything? Uh, not so bad. Not so bad. That's good. And the rest of you guys, how are you doing, Kevin? Okay. I think that you have your microphone on, but I cannot hear you. No, I cannot hear you. No se le escucha. Quizás tiene que conectar, desconectar o configurar porque no se le escucha. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Now, now I can hear you. Yeah, yes. How's everything? How are you doing? Uh, fine. It's cool. It's cold it's today. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay. And a lot of sick. Really. Oh, you're sick. Yeah. Oh, that's, lot. that's bad. I hope you get well soon. All right, guys. Thank uh, you. How are you Thank doing you. with the platform? ¿Cómo les está yendo con la plataforma? ¿Ya comenzaron la sección 2 con los ejercicios del knowledge check? Yes. Okay. Um, and... Yo tuve problemas. Hola. Hola, hola, sí le escuchamos. Sí, yo tuve problemas en la primera semana en uno de los ejercicios. Parece que no me, no me puso el chequecito verde. Y um, en el cuestión. Ajá. Sí. ¿Sí? Y, y yo recuerdo haber escrito. Y lo volvió a realizar, trató de volverlo a hacer. Eh, sí, dos veces. ¿Y logró completarlo o no? Sí, sí lo voy a completar, ya estoy en el, en el número dos. Ah, se resolvió el problema. Ahora inicié. ¿Perdón? Sí se le resolvió el problema al final. Pues espero que sí, ya no regresé a ver si ya tengo el, el cheque. Ajá, cheque. El chequecito verde. Sí, cheque, lo revise y chequeé. si no, pues mándenos fotos y avise, pues, porque así eh, es importante eh, que esté todo resuelto okay. y porque creo que la mínima para pasar es ocho. Entonces, si los ejercicios no están completos 
o todavía no se los registra, le van a salir como malos o como no resueltos y eso le va a bajar punta, eh, puntuación, así que hay que revisarlo. Recuérdense que esta ya es la okay. segunda semana de clases y solo son cuatro, ¿verdad? Entonces hay que estar al día y, y cualquier cosa pues hay que, hay que notificarla para que no nos vaya a generar problemas, ¿verdad? Ok. Okay, I'm really happy to see you. It's nice to see you. Um, a pesar de la dificultad, de verdad vamos a empezar. Um, gracias por estar a tiempo, por conectarse a su clase. Vamos a dar inicio. Um, okay, uh, this is your class number six, meaning that we have ten classes left. Uh, yesterday, I asked you to practice and write some questions using what's this and what are these, because I told you that we were going to practice. I don't know if you completed that exercise. No sé si lograron hacer las preguntitas y ya están listos para que practiquemos lo que vimos ayer. Yes. Yeah. Yes, you did the homework. Excellent. So, um, I to, like a review, remember that if, yes. if you are going to ask for a singular thing, we're going to use what's this. And we're going to answer using it's a or an depending. And if it is plural, we're going to use the question, what are this? And then we answer they are and so on. So this is what we're going to do right now. Uh, so let's start. Uh, for example, I have this and I'm going to ask the question. Um, let me search for someone, Oscar. Let's start with Oscar Villeda. What's this, Oscar? Uh, hello, this um, this is a bear. A bear, a teddy bear, yes. A teddy bear, yes. <laughs> okay, excellent. Um, let's look for someone else. Mario. Mario, what are these? Good night. Good night, Mario. What are these? This is a... Uh... This is or they are? What the... Ah, they are, they are uh, a cell phone. Uh, cell. Oh, what that? What Car are these? Cars. Sorry. Car. Cars. They are cars. Uh huh. They cars. are cars. Okay. They are cars, or you can say they are they are toy cars. Carritos de juguete. They are toy cars. Okay. Excellent. Now let's continue, Mirna. Mirna, what's this? This is um, uh, no sé cómo. perfume. Right. Perfume. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, this, this is at poison. A perfume. Excellent. It's a perfume. Thank you so much. Perfume. Um, Let's see, Carla, Carla Guevara, uh, what are these? What are these? They, they, are, uh, they are market. Excellent, they are market. Now, let's see what else do I have here. The last one, Cecilia. Let's try with Cecilia Estrada. What is this? Mm, it's a hairbrush. Uh, yes, um, it's a comb. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the difference is that a, a hairbrush is a cepillo y peine se dice comb. Se C O M B, comb. C O M B, comb. Yes, excellent. Now, do I have volunteers to continue with the activity? Volunteers to continue with the activity. Ask your questions. Kevin Torres, no sé si está por ahí. 
Okay, Mirna is going to start. Okay, Mirna. Vamos a preguntarle a Kevin, Mirna. Kevin Torres está por ahí. Ajá, uh -huh. ask your question. No, you can ask someone else. Le puede preguntar a alguien más, Mirna. Okay, you can see here we have uh, Jonathan, Kevin Goches, uh, Wendy Padilla, Janet Pinto. Gabriela. Okay. Gabriela. Yeah. This is. What? What is this? It's the Bible. No. Oh, so it's the book. Is it, this is a book. How oh, it's this? No. It's a book. Yes. Is correct, Mila. It's a book. This is a book. Excellent. Correct. Thank you so much. Let's continue with Carolina. Aquí tengo la manita de Carolina. Uh, tengo que elegir a quién. Sí, ahí puede verlos en la pantalla. Usted elige a quién le va a hacer la pregunta. Mm. Solo a Oscar veo que tiene la manita. <ríe> a cualquiera. Los que tienen la manita van a preguntar. Aquí no la ah, bajen. Ajá. Okay. <ríe> uh -huh. uh, Mario. Ok. Mario, what is this? It's a uh, apple. Apple. An apple. Eh, no, no. Oh. Lemo. It's a, lemo. Oh, lemo. Oh, yes. Okay, it's a lemon. Yes. <laughs> lemon. Sorry. Yeah, excellent. La cámara yeah, yeah. Sí, se parecía, parecía una manzana, okay. limón, naranja. <laughs> the camera. Yeah, that's okay. Thank you so much, Carolina. Okay, sí, yeah. let's continue with Oscar. Okay. okay. Eh, Manuel. Yes. What is this? This is a cell phone. It's a cell phone. Excellent. Okay, Thank another you. volunteer? More volunteers? Okay. I am. Okay, Manuel. Um, stem. Um, Doris. 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 No. no. Doris Coreas. No. Um, or or um, Gabriela Argueta. Okay. Gabriela Argueta. Uh, what is this? This is, I don't know, say gorro in English. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, no sé qué es el gorro. How do you say that in English, Manuel? Bar no. Hmm? Hat. 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 No. Yeah, hat. 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 It's a hat. It's a hat. It's a okay, hat. thank you so much. Let's continue with Cecilia Estrada. Thank you so much, Manuel. Cecilia? Oh, thank you. Hat. H-A-T. 
¿Se dice igual que sombrero? Yes. Ok, gracias. Mm, ok, Jonathan, what are these? Oh. Yes. Jonathan, what are these? Creo que no está. Okay, you can select another participant. Um, Kevin, what are these? Okay, your microphone. Hello, hello. Yes. Hey, teacher. Yeah. What are they these? Are, they are keys. They are keys. Excellent, they are keys. Okay, tengo la manita de Mario. Mario, okay. <clears throat> okay. Um, la, la pregunta para la teacher. <laughs> <laughs> What is? Ah, oh, it's a it's a guitar. <laughs> nice. Okay. <guitar. laughs> is someone else? Alguien más? Okay. Thank you for your participation, guys. You did an excellent job. Excellent. Well done. Uh, so we're going to move on, and we're going to continue with the um with today's presentation. So the next thing is that we are going to watch the video about uh, um, yes, no, and where questions would be. So there are two kinds of questions. As I told you, remember, hay dos tipos de pregunta. En todos los tiempos gramaticales hay dos tipos de preguntas. Son las yes, no questions, las que podemos responder con sí o con no, y las WH questions, o también se conocen como information questions, que son en las que proveemos información. No solo contestamos con sí o no, sino que tenemos que dar detalles, información. Lo que varía es la estructura, dependiendo del verbo y del tiempo, Así vamos a, a ir variando la estructura. Ahorita estamos estudiando la estructura con el verbo be. So let's watch the video. Vamos a ver el video. Y luego vamos a explicar más a profundidad y vamos a practicar sobre este tema. I don't know if you can see my screen. Can you see my screen? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Vamos a cargar otra vez porque por alguna razón no, no corre el video. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn how to form yes, no, and where questions would be. We'll start by listening to a quick audio program which illustrates how this topic is used. Oh no, where are my car keys? Relax Kate, are they in your purse? No, they're not, they're gone. I bet they're on the table in the restaurant. <sighs> Excuse me. Are these your keys? Yes, they are. Thank you. See? No problem. And is this your wallet? Hmm. No, it's not. Where is your wallet, Joe? In my pocket. Wait a minute. That is my wallet. Let's try to make sense of the chart that you see on the screen. In order to form yes or no questions, 
we're going to follow the next formula. Derivative to b plus this, or in this case could be these, plus some kind of complement. So, verb to be plus subject plus complement. In this case, we want to say that the subject is uh, this or these. So, let's try to make some examples. As you can see on the screen, the example is this your wallet. We have the verb to be, in this case happens to be is, and then we're going to use this, the complement in this case is your wallet. And then of course we put a question mark there. Um, the other example that you see on the screen, are these your keys? Uh, we have a verb to be, these, your keys and of course we put a question mark at the end. Let me give a couple of more examples. Is this your cell phone? Question mark at the end. Are these Your things. In order to answer this type of questions, you're typically going to answer with yes, it is, no, it's not. If it's plural, for example, yes, they are, no, they're not. Now that we understand yes or no questions with B, let's explore WH questions with B. We're going to follow a similar rule for WH questions. Let me go ahead and put that on the screen. WH word plus verb to be plus subject plus complement. The rule is very simple and it's quite similar as making yes or no questions. The only difference is that now we are adding a WH word. So what are WH words? Let me explain. We use WH words to get information from others. For example, who, what, when, where, how, why are some examples of WH words. Now let's put that rule into practice. If we look at um, the example on the chart, right? We can see the question towards the right hand side. It says, where is your wallet? So if we follow that rule, we're going to put a WH word plus the verb to be plus some kind of complement, wallet. And of course, we put a question mark there. Where is your wallet? Where are my keys? How are you today? Why are you hungry? Where is the police station? To answer WH questions, you now need to give information. For example, for the question, where is your wallet? Notice that the answer is it's in my pocket. And also, all those questions that you heard on the conversation a few minutes ago. Now, it's your turn to make as many examples as possible. Practice making yes or no questions and WH questions. You should answer those questions as well. The more you practice, the easier this topic will become for you. Okay, what can you say about pocket. the video? Yes. Okay, and what are your takeouts from the video? What can you tell me about? What did you understand about the video? ¿Qué entendieron acerca del video? ¿Qué me pueden decir del video? 
la forma en cómo vamos a formular las preguntas. Ok, ahí nos explica la forma para hacer las preguntas, la estructura que se debe seguir. Mario, dígame, Mario. Bueno, de la conversación o de todo lo que habló. Hola. De, la, de las estructuras. Uh -huh. ah, no de que usted se acerca el video, pero no sé si de, la, de lo que habló. De la estructura o de, o de la conversación. Ajá, tenemos una conversación en la que se está usando la estructura de ambas preguntas. Y él, él también se explica cómo okay. formular las, las preguntas. Ajá. Y se les pide que hagan ejercicios adicionales, que formulen sus propias preguntas. Eso es lo que vamos a estar haciendo en la clase. Gracias, Mario. Eh, no sé si tienen alguna pregunta respecto al vocabulario de la conversación. Solamente teacher. ¿Teacher? Sí. Solamente agregar algo, algo, un punto, algo claro, lo que estoy viendo en la conversación, que se están dando los tres puntos que, que están explicando, bueno, que, que, que la persona ahí en el video estaba explicando los tres puntos de hacer la conversación, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, en el primero dice, oh no, where are, where are my car keys? Esa es una de las, de las, de las formas en, en que se pregunta. Luego está el, are these your key? Esa es la segunda. Y, ese, y la última sería, is this your wallet? Entonces, esas serían como las tres estructuras, ¿verdad? La forma de, de, de pregunta en lo que, en lo que puedo, puedo entender. Entonces, solamente para aclarar y tener un poquito de, de ojo ahí. ¿verdad? Excelente, muy buen recap. Excelente, gracias. Eh, Manuel. Teacher, eh, yo comp comprendí bien o mal que eh, existe la, la forma de, de yes, no question, pero uh -huh. no me queda muy claro donde dice eh, WH. Question, ¿Es un, ¿es un tipo, eh, una forma de preguntar? Sí, es, de hecho son dos tipos de preguntas, ¿verdad? La yes, no question es un tipo de pregunta. Son las que respondemos con sí o con no, ¿verdad? Respuesta corta. La WH question son las que se, también se conocen como information questions. Tenemos que dar información y se llaman WH questions porque comienzan o siempre incluyen una palabra que lleva WH. Por ejemplo, where, what, which. Ya vamos a ver esas palabras. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, any other thing that you would like to add or ask? Puede llevar el why también. Sí, también why es una WH word. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Ya vamos a ver todo eso. Vamos a practicar un poco de pronunciación y luego vamos a ir con las WH words. Que, ¿Cuáles son las más usadas y qué significan? Ok, uh, let's practice this conversation. Let's repeat. Oh, no. Where oh, no. are my car keys? Where are my Where car keys? keys? Ajá, uh -huh. remember that it is keys. 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 Ajá. Uh -huh. No keys. Keys es beso. Keys. Ajá, uh -huh. este es un poquito más largo. Keys. 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 Ajá, uh -huh. y no es tan como I, I, sino que es como más como para the keys. Así como, mm. como, como que sí la va a decir y no. Keys. keys. Where are my car keys? Yeah. Where my car keys? Excellent. Where are my car keys? Where my car keys? Excellent. Where my car keys? Where are my car keys? Where my car keys? Where my car keys? Uh huh. Where are my car keys? Where my car keys? Where my car keys? Excellent. Relax, Kate. Relax. 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 Okay. Are they in your purse? 
Are they in your purse? No, they are not. They are gone. No, they are not. They are gone. They are gone. I bet they are on the table in the restaurant. I, I, I bet they are on the table in the restaurant. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Are these your keys? Are these your keys? Yes, they are. Thank you. Yes, yes they, are. they are. Thank you. Thank you. See, no problem. See, See. No, problem. No, problem. no problem. And is this your wallet? And uh, is this is your, your wallet? wallet? Mm, no, it's not. No. No, it's not. It's not. It's not. No. Where is your wallet, Joy? Where is, Where is your wallet, wallet Joy? In my pocket. In, In my, my pocket. pocket. Wait a minute. Wait, Wait a minute. minute. That, means... that is my wallet. That is my wallet. wallet. Good. Now, do you have any question about vocabulary? Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? They are gone. Se han ido, han desaparecido. Ajá, están desaparecidas. They are gone. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other question? What did you say? Um, pocket? Pocket. Okay. Pocket significa bolsillo. Eh, okay. Pockets son las bolsas de la ropa, la bolsita del pantalón, de la chaqueta, del jeans. Esos son pockets, bolsillo. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Good. Any other question mm. before we continue? I bet there. I bet there. I bet. I bet. Cuando usted dice I bet, es como yo creo o puedo apostar. Ajá, apuesto que están sobre la mesa. I bet, ah, el they are, es ellas están, ¿verdad? Ajá, refiriéndose a las llaves. Son están a, a, hablando sobre la llave. I bet, apuesto que están en la mesa del restaurante. Ajá, when you say I bet, puede ser a, yo le apuesto a, a esto o yo creo que. La expresión I bet es yo creo, de, ajá, como cuando usted está adivinando. O también apostar a que algo es cierto. Es similar, ajá, es sinónimo de I think. Uh -huh. Ok, any other question? Any other? Okay, uh, let's go in groups. I'm going to create group sessions so you can practice. As you can see, there are three, three participants in the conversation is Kate, Joe, and the waiter. Son Kate, Joe, y el mesero, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, yo lo voy a poner en grupos de cuatro o cinco, y luego ustedes van a ir tomando turnos para practicar la conversación. As always, please take a screenshot or a picture of the conversation, and then we're going to practice. Are you ready? Ready. Perfect. Okay. Yes. Now I'm going yes. to create a section group so you can practice with your classmates. Let's see? Remember to click join or unir so you can get in groups. y el anfitrión corporativo. Ok. Ok, hagamos los diálogos entonces. Um, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. 
Muy bien. Ok, eh, ok, entonces nos repartimos el trabajo en tres. Ya en tres primero. Luego incorporamos. Ok, me gustaría hacer eh, Kate en este caso. Ajá, primero puede ser Kate, en la otra vuelta puede ser Joy y así. Ok, ¿quién sería Joy? Ok, Manuel dijo que iba a ser quién, Manuel. Kate. Kate, ajá. Puede eh, ser Joy. Joy. Ok, Erika. Okay. Erika puede ser el mesero. Waiter. 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 Ok, y luego vamos Erika? a ir en otra ronda con Mónica, ok. Ok, ok, está bien. Ok. Skate. Muy bien. Okay. Oh, no, ¿podemos iniciar ya? Ya, yeah, ya, yeah, sure. Ok. Ready. Oh, no. Where is my car keys? Relax, Kate. Are they in your purse? No, they are not. They are gone. I bet they are on the table in the restaurant. Excuse me. Are, are there your key? Yes, they are. Thank you. See, no problem. And is this? And, no. and, oh, see, and, see. and is, this, is this your wallet? Um, no, it's not. Where is your wicked wallet, Joy? It's in my pocket. Wait a minute. That is my wallet. Excellent. Okay. You did it very, very good. Now let's start now with Monica. Monica, puede empezar ahora, Kate. And okay. And oh no, where are my car keys? Excellent, Monica. ¿Quién sigue? Manuel. Okay, Relax, Manuel, let's go. Relax, Kate. Are they, are they in your purse? No, they aren't. No, they are not. They are gone. I bet they are on the table in the restaurant. Okay, the waiter. Excuse me. Excuse me. Are these your keys? Yes, they are. Thank you. See? No problem. And is this your wallet? Um, no, it's not. Where is your wallet, Joel? In my Where pocket. Where is your wallet, Joel? Wait, uh, Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That is my wallet. Ok, excelente. Ya el segundo okay. le salió mucho mejor y si siguen practicando van a ver que van a mejorar un montón. <ríe> ok, I will check another group. Voy a ir a ver otro grupo. Okay. ok, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Ok, continue practicing. And is this your wallet? Wallet. 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 Is not wallet. Mm, no, it's not. Where is your wallet, Joe? In my pocket. Quite a minute. Um, that is my wallet. Excellent, excellent. And this is in this phrase. Se une, wait a wait a minute. Ah, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Se une wait. como que fuera una er wait a wait a minute. Wait a Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Excellent. Just repeat. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Igual que la canción de Bruno Mars. Wait a minute. 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 Teacher, we had a question. Question? Uh, yeah, tell yes. me. Yes, tell uh, me. 
uh, what's of the pronunciation of word I bet or I beat? I bet. Uh, I bet. Como con I bet. E. Ajá, así como se ve, ah, esa sí es okay. que facilita se, porque así se va. Se I bet. tal cual. I bet. Ok. Ok. Se agregó uno más ah, ahí, sí. creo. Este, Melvin. Melvin, Melvin. Ay, Melvin. 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 Hi, Melvin. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Ok, ok, sí es. Ok, Melvin. Entonces, este, si quieren, Melvin, que sea Kate este día por, por eh, venir por tarde. Iniciar, correr, por venir <risa> tarde. <risa> Mel... Sorry, sorry. <risa> I am, I am bueno, <risa> ok, Melvin, Kate, este, Alexander, Joe y Juan, Kate. Eh, wait. No, Juan, Waiter. 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 Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. okay, let's go. Uh, wait, wait, wait me, please, wait me, please. Um, what conversation? Uh, who conversation? Uh, it's in the uh, WhatsApp group. Creo que la mandaron al grupo de WhatsApp. They yes. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yes, yes. Thank you, thank you. Hello, hello. Yeah, yeah, you have to start. Yes. Hey, let's go. Empiezas. Wait, 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 please. Melvin. I am, I am Kate. Yes. Yes. Okay, man. Let's start now. Right now. Um, oh, no. Where are my car keys? Cheese. Excellent key. Mm, relax, okay. Are you are they in your purse? No. They're not. They're gone. I bet mm, they don't uh, they're on the table in the restaurant. Excuse me. Are these your case? Yes. There are there are. Thank you. See, sí, no problem. And I this your wallet? Mm, no, it is not. What is your wallet, Joe? Okay, I see that some of you already finished and uh, you did a very, very good job with pronunciation. Even though we are starting, but you have a good, good sound on your pronunciation. So we're going to wait for the rest to join the main section and continue with the topic. Okay, we're missing some. Okay, uh, I think that everybody is back again. So we're going to continue. Uh, well, the question words or WH words that I was telling you before are this one, who, where, where, when, why, what, how, which, how many, and how often. Um, ese, como les mencionaba, verdad, al principio se llaman WH word y por eso también le dicen WH questions, todas las, uh, y también information questions. Cuando estamos haciendo information questions, de ellas llevan una WH word. Y les llaman así porque de alguna manera llevan W y H. WH, WH, WH. Esta la lleva como invertida, pero siempre está la WH. Right? Uh, when we use who, 
who es para preguntar acerca de una persona. Entonces, who significa quién. Where lo utilizamos para preguntar por lugar o una posición, una ubicación. Where es dónde. When es para preguntar en la ocasión, tiempo, en qué momento. When significa cuándo, cuándo. Why lo utilizamos para preguntar un, por una razón, para que nos den una explicación. Why significa por qué. Normalmente la respuesta eh, inicia con because. Because. Why are you late? Uh, si le preguntan por qué vienes tarde. Why are you late? Usted contesta because there was traffic. Porque había tráfico. Because es dando la respuesta a la explicación. Why is usually answered with because. What is to ask for a specific thing or object. Vamos a utilizar what para preguntar por una cosa específica, por un objeto, qué. Right? How es para preguntar de qué manera, de qué forma. How, cómo. Eh, which es para cuando preguntamos acerca de una elección, which, cuál. Veamos, aquí tenemos unos ejemplos, which is better exercise, swimming or tennis. ¿Cuál es el mejor ejercicio, nadar o el tenis? Which of the applicants has got the job? ¿Cuál de los aplicantes obtuvo el trabajo? How many es para preguntar sobre cantidades. El how many se usa con cosas que se pueden contar, como naranjas, por ejemplo. How many oranges do you eat in a week? Por ejemplo, ¿cuántas naranjas te comes en una semana? So, how many es con cosas contables. How often es para preguntar con qué frecuencia, qué tan seguido usted hace algo. Eh, esas son las más utilizadas y um, vamos a ver las dos estructuras en contraste, ¿verdad? La yes, no questions y las WH questions en esta estructura con el verbo be. Eh, si es una yes, no question, recuerden que al principio va a ir el verbo to be. Oh, yeah, it meaning um, is or are. Then the subject and then a kind of complement. At the end, the question mark. If we are uh, going to ask a WH question with the verb be, it's going to be this. Basicamente es la misma estructura. Si ustedes se fijan, be subject complement. Be subject complement. La diferencia es que al principio, acá va a ir una WH word. Cuando decimos WH word, estamos hablando de what, why, which, when, where, etc. Y tenemos ejemplos acá para que vean cómo la estructura se va siguiendo. B plus subject plus complement and question mark. Is our class at night? Is, is the verb be, the subject or class? Complement at night. And finally, the question. Yes, it is. Contestamos, yes, it is. El it es porque se refiere a la clase, ¿verdad? Is our class at night? Yes, it is. Uh, another example, are you Salvadorian? ¿Eres tú salvadoreño? Yes, I am. Right? Um, now, with WH word, it's where is the bank? In this case, I am asking the WH word is where. Verb to be is subject the bank. Ah, it's around the corner. I'm giving the information. Está a la vuelta de la esquina. Está aquí, después de la esquina al girar. It's around the corner, right? So as you can see, we are not answering yes. No, we are giving information. Um, Another example, where are you? Where is the WH word? Now, um, B is R, and the subject is you. And in this case, we don't have a complement, 
but we have the answer here. I am at home. We are giving the information, right? Um, I don't know if you have any questions so far. Tienen alguna pregunta hasta acá? Remember that you can take a picture or a screenshot so you can have it the, the information. So now let's com let's complete and practice the following questions. We have some questions here. Complete and practice. Uh, for example, I have the number one. Your parents from Santa Ana. What is missing there? ¿Qué es lo que le falta? The verb be. The verb be. Okay. ¿Qué sería? Your parents. Your parents. Are. Are. Are you? Excellent. Are your parents from Santa Ana? Excellent. Thank you so much. So in that way, we're going to continue um, answering the and completing. Vamos a tratar de completar utilizando que completando con lo que le falta. Si es el verbo to be, si es una wh word, si es una wh word más verbo to be. Ahí hay que completar las preguntas. Recuerden que pueden tomar una foto y eh, luego solo a uh, completar con el. Um, you can complete with the um, so the number one R and in this case, right? Que dijimos que R era lo que hacía falta por ahí. Y así van a ir haciendo las demás. Y luego vamos a chequear y a practicar. Give you a couple of minutes so you can complete them. Let me know when you finish. Excuse me, teacher. Yes, tell me. 
Guadalajara Magazines. Revistas. Ah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Melvin, do you have a question? No. I want to participate. Okay, let's wait one more minute or 30 seconds. Vamos a esperar 30 segundos. Okay, uh, let's listen. Well, the first one is, are your parents from Santa Ana? And number two, maybe? Maybe, do you have number Sorry. two? Um, when is your birthday? When, excellent. When is your birthday? Thank you so much. Kevin, number three. How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Thank you so much. Uh, let's continue, Monica, number four. And is your fa is your family family big? Ahí sí no sé si es is or are porque no sé si family es como se tomaría como un singular. Is your family? familia? Ajá, es es un hablando de un grupo eh, es una cosa. Ajá, is está bien is. Thank you so much, eh, Monica. Let's continue, Monica. Number four. In what are your magazines? Uh, what are uh, where? Where? where yes, where? Where are you? Where are your magazines? Thank you so where? much. Uh -huh. <laughs> where means done. Thank you so your... much. Kevin. Where? where are your magazines, Kevin? Kevin, your microphone. I'm sorry. Can you listen to me now? Hello? Yes. Yeah. yeah. What time is your English class? What time is your English class? That's the answer. Thank you so much. I have Carolina, number seven. Uh, which, which are your favorite actor or actress? Which are? That is a good option. ¿Cuáles son tus actor o actriz favorito? That's a good option. También podría ser who is. Thank you so much. Who is your favorite? Any of those are okay. Si tenían who is, también está bien. Okay, um, number eight. Vamos rapidito que ya se me acabó el tiempo. Are you patient with kids? Are you patient with kids? Uh huh. Number nine. Where are you, Where from? Are you from? Where are you from? And number ten. Is your language, language Spanish? Language Spanish. Uh, 
Is, uh -huh. is your first language Spanish? Good job. Thank you so much for answering the questions. Mañana vamos a rechequear las preguntas y a practicar cómo contestarlas. Pueden ir avanzando, okay. tratar de responderlas y mañana vemos esto y continuamos con los demás topics. Ok. Thank you. Okay, thank you, teacher. Bye. 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 Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.